Sleep apnea is a big problem, but many people don't even know that they have it. And in order to confirm a diagnosis, it requires some form of a sleep study. Until now, there's a new device coming to market this summer. Michael Knopisik has the story. Those sleep studies can be an inconvenience, whether you're at a clinic or at home, being strapped up to measure breathing. But a device with some initial FDA clearance that could soon be on the market through prescription could be a game changer. That's a small sensor. Uh, it's three gram heavy. You just stick it, stick it on your chin and it will measure. The CEO of Sunrise says the small device measures movements associated with the jawbone, and that can tell doctors quite a bit. In sleep apnea, we believe the jaw or the mandible is quite important. Measuring those movements can be quite helpful in terms of uh, deciding what stage of sleep people are in, whether they're having sleep apnea or not, how much the respiratory effort is. Sleep apnea can be very serious. It results in airway blockage periodically during sleep. The prevalence of obstructive sleep apnea is probably around 5% of the general population or up to 25% depending on what um, what numbers you look at. Dr. Sheila Tai is a national Jewish health sleep medicine physician. She says the condition can cause drops in oxygen saturation and waking up throughout the night. It can result in cardiovascular issues. A CPAP machine is the best current treatment aiming to achieve a restful night. The key, though, is knowing if someone needs a CPAP machine. That's where the app-based Sunrise device can help. Muscle contractions that create a movement that we're picking up and that we've been able to, you know, translate into what it means, what your brain is doing at night to keep you briefing. Physicians will get information to help diagnose from an online portal. Easy for the patients easy for the healthcare professionals. And depending on the patient, Sunrise might be just enough or additional sleep studies could be required. Sunrise is expecting a June launch in the United States.